Cuba's Communist Party has held a Congress in Havana that's been as emotional as it was historic. The man who drove the revolution in 1959 and then led the country for almost half a century was given a rapturous welcome when he appeared in the Congress Hall. The party faithful knew that 84-year-old Fidel Castro, who handed power over to his brother after becoming seriously ill, was about to give his farewell speech. The Congress has had to tackle some desperate issues, economic and social, to keep Cuba's massive debt burden in check. Among the reforms, freeing up the property market, at least a little, and allowing more private enterprise. The party also considered limiting future leaders to a maximum of two five-year terms.